way to the Corona uh, Earth Day event here in Isabella at Royal Isabella, kind of a side shoot of uh, Royal Isabella's property. Um, it's called La Casona. And so I've never been to this side of uh, Royal Isabella. They have a lot of property here, um, but I've heard it's beautiful, so we're excited to go check it out. and never did. So this is the old casona, the old, the old house that they were going to use. Uh, and then in the distance here you can see the stage for the uh, music and also right here is where they're having some chats and some other little photo ops and of course corona opportunities to buy beer and things. <laughs>
Okay, so we are here with Eugenio Lopez, and he is the I'm part of the team of the Patria Conservation Trust. And, uh, so you help put this event together and yes, kind of to, to bring light to the I'm the designated batter. Okay. <laughs> Whatever needs to happen. <laughs> he does all everything. So. So what kind of, how did this come together? How did it, how did you? Yeah, it's a little bit of a dream come true. Uh, we have the Royal Isabella and Cosa Isabella, who I work for. Uh, when they started the development, they seeded 89 acres of land to create El Pastillo Conservation Trust, which is this, this logo right here. Okay. Which is the little butterfly. It's ah. endemic to Puerto Rico. And um, it's protecting big part of the coast here in Isabela, yeah. almost half of the municipality. Wow. And we've joined forces with another amazing entity, which is the Save the Beach Foundation or Trust, which is by Corona, done by Corona. It's it's really a dream made in heaven because they've been doing an amazing job and so have they, they uh, Pastillo. Yeah. So they wanted to do something special and we asked the owners of the land and they allowed us to use this beautiful space. We've been to Royal Isabella, but we've never been to this. We didn't even know this was here. This is really cool. Yeah, it's a good view. It's incredible. It is. Hopefully, so will it be able to be accessed by the public in some way? It is, it is private, but we wanted to do an educational forum so people understand the work that's being done. All the vegetation that you're seeing that falls from the cliff, that's part of the conservation trust. So hopefully in the future we'll be doing more of this. Okay, yeah, and hopefully more to, to encourage the public to... And keep, keep building conscience and, and uh, education is really the key for everything. Right. So really, uh, we're really happy because uh, you can really see in the event today that it's really a very special event, very unique. It's the first time they do it. And as we're all witnessing, People came here for birthday. They didn't came to come to drink or party, and you know, you're having that's a good a, that's time. A side part of it. Yeah, they're <laughs> having a good time, but everybody's very engaged. So we 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 feel that we're achieving our objectives. Yeah, it's great. Sense. We're having a great time. Well, thank yeah. you for helping put this together. Yeah. Thank you for awesome. being here. <laughs> so right now there's a chat or a charla um, going on with the famous musical artist Siete. Uh, in the distance, he is talking about the benefits of veganism or vegetarianism on the planet uh, and on your health. So let's go see what he has to say. Yo ahora puedo correr mucho más que antes, puedo hacer más ejercicio que antes, puedo hacer más pull-ups que antes, sabes, puedo hacer un montón de cosas más. Pero y uno se siente en general mejor, sabes. Yo creo que uno envejece mejor. Pasan dos cosas. Uno, a lo mejor la dieta que estabas teniendo no era balanceada, porque uno suele. Gracias a ustedes por venir, gracias por escuchar. Espero que, espero que se lleven algo bueno. So check out the view from up here. From this view, you can see the exit of the Oaxaca Tunnel and the beach that's beyond the Oaxaca Tunnel, which from what I understand is called Pelican Beach, uh, Playa Pelicano. And look at this beautiful stretch of road beneath it. I think we're gonna have to go explore it sometime. <laughs>
Oh, Pachio Beach. We've been, we've been here a few times before, but it's kind of fun to see it and learn a few new facts. I'm pretty fun. Pero qué tipo de árboles? Es un uca. Uca, uca. Okay. Por este lado se viene. Está bien Por este lado. Por este lado se ve. Is uh, the tour going well? Is everything happy? Muy bien, todo ha sido muy chévere, muy bonito todo. Ah, oh, perfect. <laughs> Down the way, a little way down this uh, trail, we arrived at La Posa del Pasillo. This is Pasillo Beach. It's also called uh, part of La Playa Puerto. So they kind of have two little names, but this is a nice little area. And the Posa just means it's an area where you can swim without really fighting the waves because the rest of the ocean beyond has pretty strong waves. I just finished uh, planting my tree. We just put some water on it. So this is my. Uh, my uh, sea grapes, uva de playa. We each planted one. I got a little bit dirty on my knees, but it's looking good. So we'll see how it grows in a few years or hopefully it stays good. But remember which one it is. Go, go, go. Yo fui hasta ahí. Salva el ajedol. Un del ajedol de la base del árbol y ahí. Eh, discúlpame, tú estás cerrado. No, es eh, video. No, pero la explicación es que. <laughs> What do you got, Aiden? Thank you. 
respira Ley al cacurria, tu dodo, mame, una foto y mira So now we are at the end of the path that they created out here and there is a lookout spot, a mirador. So we're going to go check that out next. Okay, so now we are up here on this platform overlooking Castillo Beach. That was what we were just hiking and walking. Look how beautiful it is. So down on here, this is the La Posa, where we were hanging out right there. And back in the distance, it looks a little different now, but you would see the, the Cara del Indio. A oh, pretty view up there. La culpa de ellos, es culpa Puerto Rico que pensamos que solitos somos demasiado chiquitos y queremos todo fácil cuando hay que protestar y mandar para el carajo a la junta de control fiscal y mandar para el carajo al gobierno si nos falla, mandar para el carajo al que quiera nuestra playa y decirle. Que no y solamente sígueme. Tú solo baila y con movimiento castígame. Mírame, mírame y cuando lo consumes y haces mucha bulla, entonces suba el volumen. No te hagas la que no sabe si todo el mundo también lo hace. Con ese cuerpo no me complaces. No diga que te cogí fuera de base. Y no te hagas la que no sabe si todo el mundo también lo hace. Con ese cuerpo tú me complaces. No diga que te cogí fuera de base. No me pongas excusa, quítate la blusa. Pinta y acusa pa' que no pesa tu saya. Tu es no me importa, tú sabes que yo pierdo. Es la era de mi bulla, paso la del nerd. He's on fire again, game over, no more play. Llevo el rey every day. Dime what you say. Y dame un break, el día le pongo a play. Contigo tú te amaneces, ¿qué te parece? Te desapareces y lo haces con bastantes veces. No me digas que no y solamente sígueme. Tú solo baila y con movimiento castígame. Mírame, mírame y cuando lo consumes y haces mucha bulla, entonces suba el volumen. No te hagas la que no sabe si todo el mundo también lo hace. Con ese cuerpo tú me complaces, no diga que te cogí fuera de base. Y no te hagas la que no sabe si todo el mundo también lo hace. Con ese cuerpo tú me complaces, no diga que te cogí fuera de base. En la cara se te nota que eres entrar en acción. Cuando te subo la nota se te baja el pantalón. La cuestión es que de todos eres la que sobresale. Cuando entres sales y modales sale. Estoy atento. 